I got a family to feed, so let's get into this tea. We about to get into um, Krishan's updated court situation that she had today. Um, basically, it says Krishan update. Krishan appeared today in court alongside her attorney at court. Two issues are at hand. First being for 30 days for community service, which began on 8-7-24. According to court docs, once she serves that time, 9724, she would be able to bail out on set bail of 25000 while she fights the app to accelerate charge in court on 92724. Now, I don't know what app to accelerate charge is. What is app to accelerate? All right. Application to accelerate requires a hearing. The prosecutor must prove that the probation terms were violated but only by a preponderance of the evidence, a fairly easy burden of proof to meet. The burden of proof is only a, is only a showing that the violation is more likely to have happened than not or, or 51%. Cassandra did do the breakdown bit. So it's given, um, Krishan basically doing her 30 days right now up to September 7th. Um, and then she'll have a bond. However, she's going to have to go back to court on September 27th. This is how I feel. Blueface is in jail, okay? If I was Krishan, I would sit my ass down. Now, I know y'all want her to go see Junior. I know, I know, I know, girl. I know. My problem is Krishan is technically a flight risk to them. So they probably going to give her ass an ankle monitor. And I don't even know if she going to be able to leave. I could be wrong now. And I'm about to definitely watch the breakdown of Cassandra. Cause Lord knows she can explain it better than me. But, um, that's just my opinion on the situation. Uh, um, being that she's technically a flight risk. I see them not, um, you know, not, not letting her just bail out and just go back to LA. I'm finally Craig County jail. This is six days ago. I didn't react to that. All right, let's read. Hey, <laughs> yes, Buttercup, what's up, Buttercup, what's up, L.A. Reese? Um, hey, just Audra, hey, Heidi, hey, Lee, did it play? I thought summertime that, you know, that was my time to, you know, kind of play around with YouTube and stuff. But once August hit and them kids start school, baby, I've been running. So I have... Um, my younger two started school yesterday. Y'all, she's talking to her live as she should. Hey, yeah. Okay. Well, Traveling Princess, yeah, that YSL trial has been um That's has another been doing thing we got to get into. I always look at events. If I don't see nothing, I'm John's docket screen cuz All right, here we go. All right. So this is Krishan's docket. Um and I always look at events. If I don't see nothing, I'm not going to come on here and be like, okay, da 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 da, because I got to see what's on the docket. So it does show that she was placed on the revocation acceleration docket. All right. Because we know that's what her, um, that's why she was arrested because she violated her probation and an application for acceleration was filed. So they have to place her on a proper docket so that way she can go before the proper judge. So whatever judge that she went to um, this morning, I'm pretty sure it was probably about a good five minute because five minutes um, at the most. The only reason why I say that is because yes, if she- Did you say friend? You react to Woody's interviews. What interviews? Oh, no, they don't copyright. She was um, scheduled for one thirty. Y'all got it. I don't know if some of y'all have been to court, but you have about 50 people scheduled for one thirty. So the judge got to go through them. OK, and so this was probably just a hearing to schedule her for the revocation acceleration docket. 
that's all I got for you. So when she goes back in September 24, uh, 27th, that is just her to go before the proper judge and they're going to discuss her, um, her probation, uh, damn, <laughs> her <laughs> probation violation, <laughs> AKA the revocation and the application for acceleration. Now, at the same time, that judge right then and there can say, okay, this is what's going to happen. Or, this is about Krishan. Or he can say, okay, we're going to set this for 10 days out or 30 days out or 45 days out. And we're going to, and when I say set it out, that means that they're going to schedule it at a later date. But at the end of the day, it is still up to the judge. I want you guys to stop. <laughs> and I say, you guys, I'm not saying everybody in the chat, stop trying to figure out how much time Krishan is going to get. Nobody is the judge. Okay. Nobody is the judge. I have done a video to show you the charges that it carries for each of those, um, the sentence for those charges. All right. That is it. That is it. That is it. Um, yeah, the court date, you're not, the court date was not placed on the docket. The court date is not was not placed on the court date. Yeah, the court date was not placed on the docket. Somebody actually called the courthouse, and like I said, y'all know how I am about calling the court courthouse. Um, so yeah. So now, what happened today? I don't know. You know, if she was released on bond, then that is something that only her and the attorney in Craig County. Now, if I go to Craig, you know what? Let me see, because sometimes. Take us to Craig County, girl. Let's see. Okay, let me see. Let me see. I'm going through the uh the thing. I don't be knowing. I'm talking about some people feelings about Krishan update. Oh yeah, people is thrown off. Uh, hey Cassandra, you know, uh, you it's know, Leo, so I was flying to your page for a good understanding. <laughs> Thank y'all. Thank y'all. Hey, Miss Bug. I don't think I said hi to you. You're welcome. Y'all are very welcome. Uh, the court day. What is going on? My site. I think I got about 20 tabs open. Yeah, she's still on there. Once she once she drops out of there, then, you know, that's how we know she's out. I don't. Oh, my God. Look who Krishan is in there with. Lord have mercy. Don't be um, going on Vine and stuff because Vine is like, it's delayed. Because the just court doc, the, um. The inmate, whatever they use, you know, that's going to update. And then the information got to be transferred to Vine. So, um, yes, she's got a bond. I mean, if she does, I don't know. I'm not calling the courthouse to find out. Okay. Um, I got facts. Got a bond. Um, I hate when I do this. She says, uh, got a bond of 25000 after she finishes her day. You know what? I ain't even go. Let me see. Yeah, I got a family to feast. Uh, I I love this. Yeah, I'll tell you, I've been working since 425 this morning. I'm tired of reading damn court dockets. I get it. <laughs> All right. So let's see. It says Judge Garner presiding, Erin Quinn for the state. Defendant was present with her attorney. Oh, and attorney. they gotta make sure she's not a Native American, because y'all know Oklahoma um and Native Americans, it's a whole thing there. Um, let's see, not enrolled in any federal recognized tribe. All right. They yeah, are held everybody on, that was on that docket looked crazy as hell. Application to accelerate uh, the Leo. waves rights to a hearing within 20 days. State waves hearing within 20 days. Case is set on the revocation docket at 10.30 a.m. Bond is set at 25000 on the application to acceleration. Defendant to serve, defendant to serve out 30-day commitment with time beginning on August 7th. 2024. <laughs> I gotta read it like that because I'll be reading the comments. I swear I'll be reading the comments. Oh, yeah, I don't know what she's talking about. Da, 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 da. That's the whole purpose why she got arrested because of the order for commitment. But I don't know nothing. I just do this for fun. I, I really do. <laughs> Uh, I'm not trying to figure it out. I just want her to get her sense in this so people can stop. So, girl, people keep asking me. I've been ignoring folks. Don't come and ask. Talk about how you get eight years. Yeah. What you say? My judge reinstated my crazy ass. So who knows? My baby was turning one. This was 11 years ago. 
And even though I violated, I was only looking at 90 days. I did 24, pulled up to someone's house and we did. Uh, did you get extradited? Y'all added four years plus four years and you come up with eight. But I'm just going to let people run with that. I'm going to let people run with it because the Internet is free if you pay your bill. <laughs> Sounds like I rubbed up on the I'm <laughs> just saying. The Internet is free. You can search it. I ain't got time um, to do this. You know, explain and explain and explain and people still don't get it. So I'm going to let you run with whatever narrative you want to run with. And that's how I am because I got better things to do like work and deal with my kids and go fishing and go on vacation. Um, I mean, because y'all people really be trying it though. It's funny that you said um, I rubbed up on Cassandra like <clears throat> I think in the beginning like everybody try to be nice, you know and be, you know, not be rude and not tell y'all we at work and things like that. I know I was doing that for a long time. Like so people started saying little shit about me and money. That really had me like, oh, okay. Y'all got me bent. Because first of all, um, I've never came on this platform and bragged about nothing. Not one pinkest damn. Okay? And when it comes to money, I'm at work. There's no way you think these lights be on for free. You know what I'm saying? Like, but it's a lot of factors that play into what it is that I do and how I do it and what all the platforms you got to be on and shit like that. Y'all, this shit is a lot. So I'm not just on here like, can y'all buy me a bottle tonight for the club? Like, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? What the fuck? I'm at work in real life in real time. Okay. Running several channels on several platforms. I got a lot going on. So it's like, if you rock with me, clearly I give all options and I got a lot of free ones. So it's like, come on, bro. Stop playing with me. Both of us post videos while recording a video, doing a thumbnail. Let's not forget about that. So it's just like, come uh, on. Ara said, I hope she's released, but a cup says, long. so basically she's not out of the woods yet. No, but we know that she did start her 30 <laughs> days on the 7th. Of August. Yes. And with Oklahoma, you doing your 30 days. I don't care what you're saying. Uh, can you explain what revocation acceleration? Okay. So it's the revocation. So anytime you do probation. Oh, damn. Anytime you violate your probation, that means that your probation has been revoked. So that's what the revocation portion is. The acceleration when they filed her um, the application for what is that? The application to accelerate. They want to say, okay, well, since she's uh, has violated all of these rules, we want her for just we want her to just go ahead and serve her sentence, whatever the judge feels within the certain time frame that those char the sentence that those charges carry okay so it's not like oh okay this is four years this is four years we're going to add them together in eight years i don't know where the hell people are getting 30 years from that's just it that baffles me go back and watch the previous videos and you'll see where i broke down the charges and the sentences the judge cannot go over that so in all if he said okay Krishan, i'm giving you five years but i'm going to defer that and you're going to do this instead that's what it is okay so probation violation means that well she violated that so the judge revoked her probation that's where you got the revocation is Okay. Um, Michelle says there, Latonia. Hey, um, good morning, Natalie. I don't know where you at, but it's one fifty nine here in Dallas, Texas. <laughs> <laughs> yep. $25,000 bond. So she's going to be out a couple of days after Junior's birthday and she will give him a party. We will see Shay Stevenson. Wait, Shay Stevenson. Who's Shay Stevenson? <laughs> and I, I did forget that that was around Junior's birthday and shit. I don't blame her for going out to see Junior. I know it's not all about Blueface, but y'all know for Krishan, it'd be all about Blueface. So don't come for me. Um, but I will say that her just not following rules correctly and not taking things serious. I don't know if Krishan has been in jail now and is like, when I get out, 
I'm taking everything seriously. Everybody don't work like that. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Niggas will still go to jail for 10 years and still get out and go rob a bank like they did when they went in. You know, so I don't want her to get out and think she can get away with it again because she know they're not going to come extradite her fast. You know what I'm saying? So I, I'm not looking... I, Clearly, Junior deserves the world, but Prashan got to really get her mind right. You know what I'm saying? Um, we all know that Oklahoma ain't just about to pull up, hop out on her. But she do know L.A. County will come get her. But L.A. County did come get her because of James, not because of Oklahoma. So I'm just saying, if she knows all this information, I don't know if she in there talking to the inmates. The inmates like, girl, when you get that bail on... Um, <laughs> Uh, September 7th, leave. Don't come back. Like I don't know. I just don't know. So I think she should sit it out till it's done. Sit it out. I don't know who Shay Stevens it is. I can't even see him. And shout out to my new mods. Y'all are awesome. Your bond revoke if you violate. Well, okay. So there's certain things that can happen, Granny. So if you can, okay. You violate your, your probation. What they can do is they can say, I'm reinstating this and you do this, or they can, well, no, they're going to revoke your probation. I'm saying that totally backwards. So you violate your probation. They file usually what is called Oklahoma does it different in tech. All states actually does it do it different. So what they'll do is file a motion. So in Texas, we file a motion to revoke. What Oklahoma did, they did, filed a application to accelerate. It is still the same thing as a motion to revoke your probation. So that's why we see the revocation and acceleration docket. It <clears throat> simply means the same thing. They just name it differently. That's all. Um, I love Spotty. Turns out she was telling the truth. Yeah, I still don't be uh, listening. I don't listen to none of them, to be honest with y'all. Oh, God. Uh, they tell me, yeah, I don't want to talk about. We get the truth over here. I sure hope so, because if I don't be telling y'all the truth, I need to find me another profession. Um, the fact that Harvey from TMZ used to be a lawyer and ran with that. I'm going to tell y'all about Harvey. Harvey was not a criminal law attorney. He was dealing with real estate. If y'all don't know this, you can't go to a real estate attorney and say, I need you to represent me in criminal law. That's why you have different areas of law. Um, and so it, it's not going to work out. And the reason why I'm saying this is because when you go after you take that bar, <sighs> man, like, for instance, my sister is going to law school, but she goes to law school in Vermont. So there she can get um, her law degree in like business. And there's other different areas of law, not per se criminal law or personal injury or things of that nature. Now, you learn the base basics, torts and all that other stuff. But that does not mean that you're going to be knowledgeable in that area. It's like you pass the bar and then you go into whatever field you want to go in harvey was not a criminal is and who is harvey was not a criminal lawyer so i would not take uh, anything unless he sits there and he has friends that work in criminal law i'm not trusting anything that harvey <laughs> harvey says from tmz okay um y'all don't mess with her and her fit yeah please don't mess with me my fishing i i, I love that uh, the eight years was because she has two. I know. And people are adding four plus four. Lord, forgive them. <laughs> That's all I got to say. I'll be, if y'all, hey, if, if y'all want to fight me on anything. Bruh, I Krishan is not doing eight years. And I know y'all want it so bad. It's not happening at all. I, I will pay you to come work with me for a day. You will not survive because the Lord and I will say a attorney who whichever attorney I do, I'm be like this person be on YouTube acting like they know the law. We ain't going to train them. We ain't going to do dilly squat. We're just going to we're going to we're going to give them some work and see what they do. On God. Uh, da -da. Hello. Has she been sentenced? No, she has not been sentenced. Because if you see on the screen, does not show that she has been sentenced. <laughs> okay? 
of 30 days from 8-7. Yep. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Praying she can get out. I sure hope so. That'd be nice. Uh, Cassandra, why they didn't count the time she was held when they picked up? I don't know. I honestly cannot ask that. <laughs> so that is another thing. Uh, they didn't count the time of Krishan being in there. That's why I'm still listening to this video. But they didn't count the time of Krishan um, being picked up or like right when they said they was coming. However that worked, they did not count that time. We don't know why they didn't count that time because they should have counted that time. So basically, it's like Krishan basically doing an extra, um, not extra 30 days, but an extra few days on that 30. Okay. Uh, some days absolutely should have been taken off, but here we are. <laughs> I honestly do not know, but I know at the end of the day, Oklahoma wanted her back in Oklahoma. So I don't think y'all have to realize when she viol she violated her probation when she didn't even check in for orientation. So even though she was incarcerated in Los Angeles, it would make sense in our minds that, okay, since she is car car incarcerated, let's go ahead and, you know, count that time from, the, you know, the time that ended from the California 30 days to whenever. But no, they, they wanted her. I think because she was incarcerated for James. She originally went into L.A. County Jail for James. But that time of her being extradited or her waiting to be extradited should absolutely count. But Kentucky, uh, not Kentucky girl, uh, Oklahoma, like, bitch, it's going to start when we say it start. <laughs> like, what? Wait a minute. Like, her to wait until she got in Oklahoma to go before the judge. This judge made the decision that she is going to serve her 30 days, like I told y'all before, but we didn't know exactly when he was going to do that. Um, so they set that time at 8-7. Uh, glad you're back so we can get the truth. Child, I, I learned not to be fighting with these people on Child, this here internet. You and Hot T have the most accurate information. I personally scroll past the other bloggers. <laughs> I don't even follow no bloggers. <laughs> Uh, Ooh, I'm not going to answer that question because, um, yeah, 30 day um, citizen. Yep. It, it's right there on the screen. Y'all can see it for yourself next time going before the judge is t uh, 927. I have no idea when junior's birthday. I think it's like the third or the fourth. If I'm not mistaken, judges have surprised people many times. Yeah, they have. I've been in the courtroom and I just mm -hmm. be like, child, how the hell did he get off or child? Why? Yeah. I seen it firsthand. So uh, these likes don't match the views. Let's get. Oh, yeah. Thank you. Hey, I hit the like button. Hit the like button. You're always on point a certain. Honey sauce. Hook the nigga over with a little bit of steak. Some potato. Some skin and some squash. <laughs> Yay. Sir one says you don't know what you be saying you child thank you unique and blessed i you know what i learned to keep it pushing only because this is not my life <laughs> i mean people people talk about jesus you know what i'm saying i don't let nobody i'm like hey if i don't know what i am doing or saying that is fine that is fine i in just real life don't be giving a damn just know that this ain't my work I got to know what I'm doing when I'm talking to these attorneys and these clients and filing these court dockets, like uh, not court dockets, these court documents. If I don't know what I'll be saying or doing now, I'm just in the wrong profession. I just, I don't know, pay somebody to do my work for me. Right. She won't be out by junior birthday nine four. We don't know. Well, well by nine no. four, no, she won't be. Yeah. Cause if she's doing her 30 day commitment, yep. And Oklahoma is saying, hey, flat you made time. It, one, it tastes like it flat was homemade. Time. You better <laughs> get into them sauces, girl. God damn. Mm -hmm. She doing it day by day. Good as hell. All right. So 9-3 is his birthday. That would have taken my baby Good coming home. Imagine being given a bond and they still make you serve. I know. That's wild. But that's Oklahoma. Oklahoma's a red state. I told y'all. Oklahoma don't be playing. 
understand she has four years probation. She could do uh, the remaining hmm. time she has on probation, which is less than four. Yeah. See, the thing is what people are doing is they are adding. Wait, what? What time is it? Oh, Lord. Because I've been sit up here and forgot to pick up my child. Oh, Lord. Um, what they're doing is they're adding four plus four. Because she had, you know, four years probation on each. They run concurrently. All right. It's not saying, okay, if she if she is on probation for four years for the first charge, then after that four years, then the next four years, that's not how it works. They run simultaneously, concurrently at the same time. The fish. Wait. <clears throat> so. The thing what that's saying four years for one thing and four years for another thing means that she's supposed to do both of those mean four years, not eight, right? She should be out. Hopefully, hopefully if she got to serve, I think uh, a year is reasonable. Now you're talking for her charges. She only um, four years. Yeah. I have to go back and see what the maximum, I think the maximum was five years but you have that's a whole nother i have to go back and watch that video i ain't got i ain't gonna explain that today she still have pending charges she has no pending charges people she don't have no pending I'm charges gonna this she has no <laughs> pending charges i don't know why you keep saying that <laughs> uh what's the 927 okay so that is for Hear me out on the Krishan stay there. She already did time for James criminally. She does have to deal with it civilly um, because he wants the money. But that's still not having to do time. She's already done jail time for James. Boom, she got to deal with the civil part of it. I don't even know if they already did that. I thought they were supposed to have a court date to do that a minute ago. But, um... My point is that should be over with too. And now she's been extradited to Oklahoma. Now she got to pay her dues, do what she need to do in Oklahoma. Girl, she'd be done with all this. But this, apparently that makeup artist still suing her. And uh, I think one more other person. Of course, it's, um, <clears throat> excuse me. What was I going to say? It's the revocation application for acceleration docket so here and i i read that before i was here um so i'm assuming after let me see what is 927 because that means that she does her 30 days and then she goes back on the 27th to discuss her violations and I think that's what they did. So this one is saying, okay, we're gonna you're gonna serve your 30 days because that's what was ordered. Then you're gonna come back to court and we're gonna discuss the violations, the reason why your application um or your probation was revoked. I hope that makes sense for everybody. All right, because remind oh. mind you here, they filed the order i'm sorry they filed the application for acceleration and to reiterate the judges was aware at this time of the woe vicky case that was now dismissed quashed as, as well as the james wright case in which one of the charges was dropped okay mm -hmm. so right. he was very well of that right Be with that being said he still ordered for her to do 30 days flat time so that is why she is doing that right now. So uh, at this, they did not discuss any of the violations. So the 927 hearing is going to be where they discuss each of the items, each of the rules that we've seen in the application that she violated. That is what they're going to be discussing at that hearing. So that makes sense. So yeah. she's doing her 30 days. That was ordered. Mm -hmm. Then the next hearing is going to discuss her violations. I hope that makes sense. That's very simple. You can't, there, there's no other way to interpret that. No All other right. way to put it. Right. Um, these people lie so much. Talk about. So y'all, that's it. Full breakdown. 
Um, I absolutely would love for her to uh, rock out with Junior for his birthday. Don't ever think I think anything different. Rashawn got to get that responsibility factor together. Um, I, I ain't there with her, so I don't know if she already has. Maybe she in there like, I'm never doing this shit again. Um, but you know, when you get that taste of freedom, girl, don't nobody want to go back. So I just hope that when she get out, she will, you know, do the right thing. That's all. I just want to do the right thing. <laughs> I just want to do the right thing so she can get this shit over with and call it. Hey, okay. So y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section below. I just wanted to share this with y'all. Um, I'm done with this video. Love y'all. Appreciate y'all. Hey, yeah.